Okay, guys. Uh, not gonna go live again with this, just because who knows if it'll work. But uh, Jean Baptiste got the license file to me early this morning, so I thought I'd record from this point. So basically, he sent me a zip file with the GUI.LIC license file. I threw it in the Gun for IR GUI, and uh, we're gonna run it for the first time and see what happens. And it works no problem. <laughs> Awesome, okay. So now, let's plug in the gun. And we'll plug in the infrared light bar. Let's see if we can see it. All right. Gun is plugged in. Let's see if I have to do drivers. Detect guns. Nothing. So we might need a driver. Let's see if I can get device manager up. I don't know what device it's gonna show up as. definitely installed something because it doesn't come up as an unknown device all right guys future Adam here uh, unless you're really interested in watching me bumble through device manager for another 10 minutes uh, I found out the hard way or I, I guess I should say I forgot because I've programmed a teensy before and I'm I guess I'm just being stupid but anyway Technical nerdy stuff, warning ahead. Teensies don't just plug into computers and have COM ports by default out of the box. They have a pre-built-in application that runs and flashes that LED. If you saw my live stream last night, you saw the LED flash. That's actually a program that comes pre-flashed on the Teensy to tell you you didn't break it when you were doing whatever you were doing with it. So anyway, fast forward to a bunch of Googling. I opened up the uh, firmware flash tool on gun for ir and of course it didn't find it, uh, and I did some Googling, and I found out you can flash a Teensy with a special Teensy loader. So for my buddies at EHA and all the people watching this, the Arcade Adam YouTube follower, uh, I'm going to show you what I did with a the Teensy loader. You grab Jean-Baptiste's uh, firmware file, the hex file, directly from that, and then you load that. So let's jump on over there. Okay guys, after a lot of Googling and some clicking around, I think I figured this out. Uh, looks like the Gun for IR firmware flasher utility can't do this directly, so we're gonna YOLO it the hard way. Okay, so this is a Teensy flash utility. We're gonna go browse to uh, JB's firmware. I'm gonna guess that PM stands for Pro Micro and this one is the one I want. Hopefully I can flash the other one if that's not the right one. So player one, gun for IR, M, I. Hopefully that's it. And what do we do? Uh, open hex. Select program from the operations menu. Click the program button on the toolbar. Okay, we got that. Choose reboot from the operations menu. Reboot OK. Camera looks like it's working. Well, let's see if it shows up in Gun for IR. Oh, sweet. <laughs> yes. Okay, now I have a gun. Test screen. Yes. All right. Now let's plug in the infrared and see if I can see anything. Oh wait. Test tr trigger. Escape or push the trigger to quit. How about trigger button? Oh, 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 oh. wired that trigger button right. What's happening? Uh, 
Okay. Where's my other USB cord? All right, guys. We got it working. It's awesome. I'm going to spare you the boring stuff when we're going to fast forward to the good stuff. Uh, we're going to do a calibration. <laughs> it's going to work. <laughs> Check this out. Oh, the camera can see stuff. <laughs> yes. Well, these are probably super weak because that's like six inches in front of the camera. Look at that. Oh. Um... <laughs> oh, you guys can't see the little window deal. That stinks. Here's some more footage, guys. I found something that'll actually record on OBS, so you can see. This is just the extreme IR sensor bar that I'm kind of putting in front of the camera between four, four to eight inches, depending on what I get to show up. So there's two dots at the end of the infrared. Oh, there, it's trying to do some triangulation. Oh, that's cool. Oh, look at that. So it's working. Oh, these are wide angle too. And these might actually work. I might try to desolder these. And put them around my screen. But just wanted to show you that it works. <laughs> I have proof. <laughs> well, that's it, guys. Just wanted to show you that it works. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next one.